Hey YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to run Windows 95 on your iOS device as well as some others. Um, this does not require a jailbreak and uh, anyone can do this and uh, yeah, let's get started. Also get this for Windows. It's just this is the Mac version. Uh, if you want to get the Windows version, just go to 25pp.com. You should find it here. Um, it's in Chinese, so uh, yeah, it's, yeah. Anyway, <clears throat> I've already have all these files. Um, so pretty much, what the first thing you're gonna want to do is uh, hook up your phone to the computer. everything that tries to open. And then open 25pp. Oh, show this, I'll show your phone. Click on this little Apple logo. Search for the IDOS. Now what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna click this button right here. Pretty much what this is doing is it's downloading the app on your phone. So, five seconds. Good, so it looks like it's done. So, it's now on my phone. But the app won't actually run unless I click this button right here. So click this button. Like it worked, it should give you something like that. Um, let's go ahead and uh, don't really need this anymore. Let's go ahead and close out of this. Um, all right, <clears throat> so now that you have the app installed onto your phone, well, the first thing actually you want to do actually, never mind. So I'll go to your apps and you'll see iDots right here. Click on IDOS, go to your documents, and pretty much what this documents folder is, is just your C drive. So go ahead and just unzip the file you downloaded, this one right here, and then when you get it, you get something like that. I'll have these files in it. There's a file, I don't know why I put that in there. Went out bad. Um, the only folder you're gonna really care about is this one right here. So just go ahead and uh, drag all of these into here. This will pretty much install 86 DOS, um, so you can use that if you want, um, and other stuff too. Like three versions of Windows, Windows 95, Windows 3.1, um, and uh, Windows 1.0. So just wait for it. It might take a little while because it's a lot of stuff. said this but uh, all of these download links will be in the description of this video so yeah just, uh, all right so it looks like it's done so that's it you're pretty much done you've pretty much installed the emulator that we need to run on your phone and we've installed the files necessary to do that so yeah I'll go ahead and switch over to my phone now so you'll see that you now have IDOS application Click on it. Should load up like that. So, um, you can um, install some games for free. 
um, if you want. I'm not going to, and it's because of time. So go ahead and just click on here. You can rotate it. Like that. Sorry, I'm trying to hold an iPad in one hand and trying to turn it another. So you'll see you have it. Bounce prompt. You're gonna want to go ahead and just click this. Or type W I N, and you'll see that you have this. I'm trying to focus it. Oh well, it says Windows Selection Screen, BlakeRare.com, and uh, you can either do Windows One 3.1, Windows 95, or you can close it, or just do Windows 95 for this. So you'll see that it does start up Windows 95. It's really bright. Um, <clears throat> here, let me get a stylus. It's better just to use it with like a little stylus or something that you have. Um, you can see this is Windows 95. Um, So it'll give it a minute to load. Um, it'll probably give you some sort of Microsoft Scan Disk thing that it'll probably show up with within a minute, and I'll show you how to fix that and get rid of it. <coughs> so just uh, just wait. Um, yeah. So this is the thing I was talking about. Um, it'll probably give you an error in the directory structure saying that something's wrong. It may or may not. Sometimes it... Yeah, okay, so here we go. And it'll give you this. So what you're going to want to do... Oh, oh. Go here. You can type in... Fix it. Just type F. And it's going to say, like, scan this is about to make changes to drive C. And you don't really want to save anything, so just tap skip undo. And you fixed it, and um, just give it a minute to load up. And there you go, you fixed it. So, yeah. Um, just kind of, you can adjust the size of the screen if you want it to. So, oh, oh, never mind. Alright, so it's about to start up. Um, Windows 3.1 and Windows 1.0 only take a few seconds to load when this one takes, I don't know, a couple minutes or so. So, yeah, you can see this is Windows. Get a little startup sound. Alright, now I'll just do it and click OK. Yeah, that's, that's right. I'm pretty sure that might be an hour off, but oh well. Um, yeah, I mean, you have Windows 95 on your iPhone. Um, you see that you got, uh, you can, you know, I actually, I don't, I haven't actually seen anyone connect to the internet, so I don't even know if you can. I've heard that you can, but I haven't been able to, so, yeah. So, let's, uh, play some Minesweeper. Um, I'll give you, I'm not sure what happened here. <laughs> Just go ahead and go to game. Um, intermediate. I really don't even know how to play Minesweeper, so. Yeah, um, you can see this is Windows 95. It's, uh, no, oh well. Um, but yeah, you can see this is actually Windows 95. Um, we can go here. Computer. Can, it's kind of hard to um, go ahead and just kind of block this up a little bit. There we go. Oh, shoot. Yeah, that would have been a lot easier if I did that earlier. No. So, didn't. Okay. So you can see, like right here, you know. Like, uh, 
to like click and drag things, you just click on this. I'll try and do it with one hand. You can make it bigger. Drag a window around. Yeah, you get the point. But um, um no, I'm good. Um, but yeah, you can see you have Windows 95 on your phone. Um, and to make sure you don't get that error again when you start it up, um, it'll give you this thing uh, saying, "Are you sure you want to shut down the computer? Restart the computer." Start the computer in MS-DOS mode, just say shut down the computer, click yes, and um, it'll pretty much do its thing. Please wait while your computer shuts down, and it's now safe to turn off your computer, so when that happens, all you have to do is just double click, swipe up, and now you have Windows on your phone. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, Hope you enjoyed this video. Peace.